In this video, we're going to take a look at the diagnostic tools that are built into Google Wi-Fi. These tools can be used to test your internet speeds, the mesh connection between your Wi-Fi nodes, and the Wi-Fi speed of the device connected to your mesh network via the Google Wi-Fi app. To access Google Wi-Fi's diagnostic tools, we need to return to the Google Wi-Fi app. From within the app, we need to select the Shortcuts and Settings tab. Now, from within Shortcuts and Settings, locate and select Network Check. Within Network Check, you will find a number of tests that you can run. However, these tests are limited to how you have configured Google Wi-Fi. For example, if you have not created a mesh network, you will not see an option to test the mesh network. As you can see here, we have three diagnostic tests that we can run. Test Internet, Test Mesh, and test device. We also have the option to start all tests, which will run each test sequentially. Let's start by taking a look at the test internet option. This test looks at the download and upload speeds of your broadband connection by first connecting to a Google server and then measuring how fast dummy data can be downloaded and uploaded from your Google Wi-Fi network. Once the test has been completed, the results are displayed via a simple diagram that shows you your download and upload speeds, gives you a short assessment of your internet speed, along with a chart that shows you what your connection can be used for. For example, this connection can be used for the internet, SD video, HD video and 4K video. You can see that this connection has been rated fast enough for 4K video. Let's return to Network Check and test the mesh network. This test will look for weak connections between your Google Wi-Fi nodes. It is particularly useful if you're trying to place nodes around your house, as it will help to determine which nodes are not functioning at optimal levels. If you do find a node that is not connecting well with the other nodes on your mesh network, you would simply move that node closer to the other nodes or add an additional node to your network. You can see that the mesh network is given a rating, in this case great which means that the wireless network is able to transfer data at more than 100 megabits per second. If the result was OK, then the data transfer speeds would be between 50 and 100 megabits per second, and if the rating was weak, the data transfer over the wireless network would be less than 50 megabits per second. The final diagnostic test is the option Test Device. This test looks at the Wi-Fi signal strength that the device we are working from is receiving. This test looks exclusively at the quality of the Wi-Fi signal for a specific time and place in your home. If you find that the test rates your Wi-Fi signal as either fair or weak, you may need to reposition your Wi-Fi nodes closer together, add additional nodes to your mesh network, or move a node away from interference or objects that might be obscuring the Wi-Fi signal. So to recap, in this video we've taken a look at three tests that you can run on your Google Wi-Fi network which will help diagnose performance issues. These tests include a broadband speed test, a mesh node connection test and a Wi-Fi signal test. 